Hello, this is Mark McElroy. I'm here for AEG and Microphone Boutique. And we're going to talk about the EF12 tube and the VF14. Um, here's a nifty little trick. Uh, these tubes are microphonic. They go in microphones, but they tend to be microphonic even when they're new. And so there's a lot of shock mounting that goes into the, uh, the U47 clones and the original. Uh, here's a way to cut down on some of those microphonics, and um, and it's pretty easy and cheap. So, uh, they're usually glass or metal tops. Uh, even the glass tops are painted black. Um, the paint cuts down on microphonics, but it also um, cuts down on light shining out the microphone as well. Um, so this one... If I were to bet, I'd say it's glass. Um, only one way to find out. Um, but this works for metal or glass. Um, what I do, what we use uh, often, is uh, go down to your auto parts store and get some of this stuff. It's silicon tape. Um, it's about $3 for a roll. Uh, you can buy it, I buy an auto parts store because it's cheap there and, it, and it's readily available. They call it waterproof self-sticking tape or something. Um, it's made of silicon. It's good for well over 500 degrees Fahrenheit. And so um, it can be used to deaden tubes and uh, doesn't melt or cause any problems. So this actually can be used with, with any tubes in uh, microphone tubes. So, cut off a strip, that's you know, about six inches long. Now, the stuff isn't very sticky, but it sticks to itself exceptionally well. And so, that's what we're going to do. So, cut it, peel it, wrap it around the tube, give it a little stretch as you go on. I want to go around once, so I guess five inches should, should do one time around. And give it a little stretch as you go on because you want to be nice and tight. And there you go. Um, there's the seam. Where is the seam? There's the seam. It's even difficult to see. And it's quite stuck on. It's not coming off. And um, it's going to decrease. The micro microphonics is going to work uh, as a deadener. They sell tube... Um, they sell silicon rings for putting over. I've seen them for um, power tubes, uh, EL34s and 84s, even 12A7s. This, I believe, works better than the ring. And you get what for you would be a lifetime supply of deadening material for uh, $3. Um, as I said, it also works on other microphone tubes. I can find no... Um, no reason why not to on anything, uh, so uh, it's a good tip and a good way to uh, either stretch a little life out of the end of your VF14 life or just quiet down your EF12 or EF11 microphone. So, uh, thanks for watching. Um, check out uh, other videos on um, YouTube, Facebook, wherever videos are when you're watching this, uh, if there's a YouTube and Facebook in the future. And uh, i got more tips, more mic demos. And uh, any questions, let me know. Thanks.